Rolling into Hoboken, some riders learn only now that this is the start of a New Jersey transit system with fewer trains on multiple branches now through about mid-January. We need more trains. So we need we need to get places. The discontinued trains, 18 of them, plus altered routes and modified schedules will clear track space. So positive train control can be added by order of the federal government. The automatic slowdown and braking system is designed to prevent collisions and derailments caused by human error. While workers try to beat a December 31st deadline, the changes are to the Northeast Corridor Line, the North Jersey Coast Line, the Morristown Line, the montclair Booton Line, and the Maine and Bergen County Lines. Forced to deal with different train times is Ridgewood resident Judy Scott, who works in a Midtown financial office. It took two of the commuter train, the more, my morning commuter trains off the schedule, which is ridiculous. What does that mean for you? Well, you just have to adjust your schedule. Checking out the New Jersey Transit alerts on this board. She hopes her new routine works, but expects Monday morning confusion. Possibly people are going to be on a platform waiting for a train that's not going to come. Still, she and others want positive train control, remembering how the lack of it was cited as a factor in 2016's crash inside Hoboken Terminal that killed one and injured more than 100 others. I do understand there's things you got to do to take care of that situation. To help ease some of the inevitable pain, New Jersey Transit is offering a discount. A 10% savings on rail tickets and passes for November, December, and January. In Hoboken Terminal, Dave Carlin, TV 1055. For a complete list of all the service disruptions, head to our website, WLNYTV.com.